How's it going, everybody? Moose here. I am still on the road. I am headed toward Munising, Michigan to see, hopefully, the Pitchard Rocks. I am running right next to Lake Superior. Just talked to some gentlemen back there at an overlook that came from this way, and they said one of these curves had a whole bunch of gravel in it. So I'm trying to keep an eye out for that as well. Imagine I must be getting close. It's been a beautiful day. It's gorgeous weather. I've kind of went off the map a little bit. I'm just kind of riding wherever I want to ride at this point. I don't know if the map would have taken me this way or not that I made. I'm not really sure. I didn't go in depth on what roads it was taking, but I put scenic on the GPS, and I am having a blast. This road is fun, fun, fun. Curves all the way down. I have It's just been curves the whole time I've been on it. So, Mike, we have to ride, I think it's H58. On its way to Mutison, if you come up this way, I think this would be worth the trip, buddy. You would love this on your gold wing. I'm having a blast. It is just a great road. So much fun. It's right next to Lake Superior. I mean, we're running right next to the side of it. Just a freaking blast, man. I don't know where I'm going to stop for the night. It's about 3 o'clock, maybe? I'm not even sure what time it is. I like to get off the road by 6 or 7, so I'll make it as far as I make it. I do want to make it to Copper Harbor no matter what uh, before I go home. So if I don't make it there tonight, that'll be my destination for tomorrow. I'll just pop it in the map and head for it. And then uh, if I have to, I'll just do the whole ride back on Sunday. Go straight down. It won't be nearly as long. So that should be all right. I always wanted to see the pictured rock, so I'm hoping I can find it. I know it's better by boat, but uh, if I can see it by land, it'd be good enough for me. At least I'd be able to say I finally made it. Been trying to get there for the last six years, maybe seven years. Never quite get there. Quite a distance away from me, though, so I can kind of understand why I don't usually get there, but. I said about three miles back. We must be getting close to it. Man, this road is fun. The whole thing is just a big curve, man. Just awesome on a bike. Beautiful weather for it. Couldn't ask for a better day. As long as I don't hit that stone and go down, that would suck. Got about 200 miles in for the day so far. Not a lot, but I've been seeing a lot of things. Stopping, taking some pictures. Enjoying the vacation, you know. There's more to just a vacation than just getting through the rides. You want to be able to see some of the stuff. So if I gotta do a hardcore hit back on Sunday, I will. Although I would like to just take my time out of the way through. Figured about 400 miles a day would do it. I'm betting I'll have 300 in here for the end of the day on this. It is 225 at this point in time. I got no service on my phone. I got no service. It's bullshit. Did I say it was? 225? 225. So I got a little while left yet. I got about three hours before I got to start looking for a place. Not that I have to be off the road by that time. It's just nice to get off the road early and be able to enjoy some of your night. Picking her wide.
Beautiful place to ride if you ever get a chance to come up this way. Just gorgeous. I wish I'd have done this a lot sooner. All right, well, I'm just going to let this roll for a little bit. You know, on the way down the road. Try and do some videos as I go along, but I can't guarantee anything. I'm just trying to enjoy the vacation, too, and sometimes that just means not having the camera on. But until next time, you guys keep it safe out there. This is Moose. You know what I'll be doing later. I'll be talking at you. See ya.